What's up, party people? I'm John McNeil, and this is Unpeeled. Today, I'm joined by... Sage McBride. Ty West. Tim Newton. Of... Shred Kelly. What is Shred Kelly? We are an alternative folk rock band from Fernie, British Columbia, nestled right in the mountains uh, in the Kootenays in BC. And is it true that the mountains are a source of inspiration for the band? Yes, absolutely. The mountains are a source of inspiration, but also the people who inhabit them, because everyone who moves to the mountains is a, a real energetic type who likes to party and dance. And so we initially started playing for that crowd, and yeah. our music, we had to play energetic music because that's what the people were demanding. And so that's kind of how our music has grown. It was not all that to you. Right now you guys have a new album out, is it Archipelago, am I saying that yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am, uh, Archipelago, and you have a self-titled track on that, and I'm going to come to this. On that track, it gave me goosebumps, because on that tri track, there's a likeness to your voice that is very Gordon Downey-esque. Do you get that often? Yeah, you know, uh, I have been getting that yeah. a lot, and uh, I don't know, it kind of just happened by accident. Certain, certain like, words, certain yeah, words. I think it's a... A vocal styling that was very similar, and it uh, it's been yeah been getting a lot. Were, of were you a big positive. fan growing up? Like oh yeah yeah, yeah definitely. I mean um, you know uh, I think I've seen them live probably about six or seven times from high school up until now. Um, but yeah you know it just kind of they had a big year last year and maybe it sort of um, subconsciously seeped its, seeped its way in and uh, not, not, yeah. so, uh, not on every track but I think on that track that it, one, st it yeah. stood out to yeah, me like the. Right. There's certain words that carry and certain words that you cut short right. that are just very esque of right. Gord Downing. Yeah, well, I'm a huge admirer of the man. Uh, That's yeah, cool. so yeah. So what's on the go? What's next for Shred? What is Shred, Kelly? Where does that come from? <laughs> like, it sounds like it should just be a person's name that's up there just shredding, right? Like, <laughs> or is it someone like that from your hometown that it's a little poke at? Like, <laughs> we're taking your name and we're touring, but not doing what you do. <laughs> so we, we do get that after a show, so people always come and they're like, they're like, who's Kelly? Kelly. Which one yeah. of you is Kelly? And yeah. we're like, oh, there is no Kelly. But we used to have uh, an Australian in the band and one yeah. Halloween he dressed up as Ned Kelly, the Australian outlaw, okay. and he dressed up as a snowboarding Ned Kelly and called himself Shred Kelly. And ah. then when uh, I wasn't even in the band because the band played one show before I joined at the top of the mountain, and I think, yeah, it was at the top of Fernie. It was the, uh, yeah, it was the top of the Fernie Ski Hill, and uh, so we had to load our gear up on chairlifts and we played for uh, sandwiches and beer. And, was Shred Kelly in attendance? Did he, was he here before he left, like for that show? <laughs> he was, yeah. He was. Yeah, yeah, he yeah, made yeah, an appearance yeah. to like the inaugural, <laughs> you know, Shred Kelly show. You should have like had him up on stage, like <laughs> ripping down the mouth. Like, hey, last song. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so if people want to find out more information about you, where are they visiting? Uh, go to www.shredkelly.com and it's all there, all of the links and stuff awesome. like that. Is there anything you guys want to touch on before we wrap things up? Is there anything we missed? Is there a any inside dirt that I should be going for here? Ooh. How long do you have? How long do I have? <laughs> uh, we just really hope everyone, or you can check out the album. It's, uh, I think we spent a lot of time working on it and yeah. we're pretty um, happy about it and just want to share it around now. What are you most proud of on the album? Oh man, that's a weighted question. <laughs> I think um, the, the whole project, um, it was song, the songwriting was very much a group effort and um, I think that comes through uh, to the listener that there's a lot of different influences mixed in this pot and uh, yeah, it sounds pretty cool good. Sound. It's fun. Yeah. It's fun and from the heart, right? Yeah. That's all one can ask. <laughs> all right. Well, I thank you very much cool. for your time. Thank you for having us. Yeah, no problem. Cheers. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. Peace out, party people.